What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to these videos brought to you guys by Wondershare. And as you guys can see, we are taking a look at the Recover It software. So, of course, this is actually one of the best software in terms of getting deleted files back from your recycling bin, your formatted drive, your lost partition, maybe an external device like a flash drive, an SD card, or maybe you're like me and you happen to lo lose a lot of footage on a flash drive, which is what we'll be taking a look at today. But it can also get some of your data back from a virus attack or a system crash. And there's an all around recovery option as well. But the best part is that it supports all these different file types, whether it's a document in .doc or, of course, .html or graphic in .jpeg or a .psd file from a project you were working on. In terms of video, it supports everything from AVI to .mp4, audio over here, WAV files, mp3 files. There's even emails and even things like .zip files that it can recover. How cool is that? But the best part is that it can recover things from everything from RAID setups to hard drives to iPods to zip drives to pen drives. It can do it all. And of course, if you're not certain about that, you can of course get the free version and you can test out the waters and see if it's getting a handful of things. And if you wanna go ahead and recover even more than 100 megabytes, then of course you can go upgrade to their pro version. So let's go ahead and check out what they have to offer. So first of all, I'm gonna show you guys what we'll be working on today. So I have this drive, correct? I have a drive right here and it is a flash drive known as Ion Speed. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and format this drive to uh, until it is 100% clean and we're going to test out whether this thing actually really works. I'm going to hit format right in front of you guys. I'm going to hit start and we're going to go okay, goodbye ion speed and all my data has vanished. Let's go ahead and check out that drive and make sure that all that data has actually vanished and it is a 100% empty, completely empty, zero out of zero gigabytes and whatnot type of flash drive. So. What exactly should I do next? Well, we have a bunch of options, as I mentioned before, but those aren't really my problem. My system hasn't crashed unless yours has. My formatted disk hasn't really been formatted because I don't have a formatted disk. And my recycling bin is doing just fine. Thank you very much. Unfortunately, I don't have a virus. So what is my problem? Well, I have an external device, in particular a flash drive, that I actually want to get information back from. So I'm going to go ahead and choose that particular flash drive, which in this case is called Ion Speed, and we're going to try to see if this thing file finds anything. It's already found 105 files. Remember, this is a completely empty formatted drive. In the first second, it's already found, whoa, these are things that, <laughs> wow, these are files from Back in April when I was programming an electric skateboard, that's how old these are and this thing managed to compile, I don't know what, and dig it back up somehow. How insane is that? This is a completely formatted drive. It kind of makes me think, whoa, things are way more easy to recover than you might think. So yeah, as you guys can see, these are all the different things that we can do. But of course, we're going to let this finish up. And afterwards, I'll show you guys what you can actually go ahead and do after it manages to show you what it's recovered. All right, so it is pretty much done at 98%. It only took around th like two minutes. It says three minutes, but you know, it took like 60 seconds in reality, scan complete. And now I can go ahead and check out all the different things that it managed to recover. These are all files in dot, dot, dot .docs, and you can actually sort them by size. So of course, these are some of the biggest files it's found. And of course, you can sort them by name. Here's a dot .word doc, the creation date. So of course, here's something from 926, something recently I worked on. And of course, you can go ahead and give it a preview if you don't want to cover it just yet so here's something I can actually go ahead and check out so of course here's a dot word document and I can actually hit recover from here on out so maybe I want to recover a dot exe file and I'm simply gonna hit uh, let's go ahead and select this and maybe select a random file over here and I'll select this and I'm actually gonna hit recover uh, please select thought I did and this is where I'll give you the options to get pro or ultimate. I'm simply going to hit evaluate and of course select a path to save the recovered file. So I'm going to select that real quick. Wouldn't it be fitting if we recover the files directly back to the flash drive? Saving on a yep, that's fine. And just like that, I got all of my items back. There's an application that I was working on for my electric skateboard around six months ago that it somehow managed to recover. How cool is that? All in all, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If so, leave a like and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. This is going to be me logging off.